I just finished sharing this technique challenge for creating this curve template and filling it. I want to take that a step further. Rather than doing um, the first technique that I shared, which is the easiest one to follow um, naturally um, that I did in the technique challenge for merging these three layers, um, when we merge them by right-clicking and choosing Merge Down to make one layer. It um, created a permanent layer with one file. We can actually preserve these three individual layers um, very quickly and easily by first let's hold down both the Control key and the Shift key and we're going to click on each of the thumbnails in the layers to get marching ants around them. And you notice as I clicked on each one, it added to the selection. I'm going to go ahead and hit Control D and do that again so that you can see. If I hold down both the Control key and the Shift key while hitting on these thumbnails, you can see the marching ants around the first one. This added to the selection of marching ants, and the third one completed a selection of all three of the layers. Now I'm going to go to my Edit drop-down menu and choose Copy Merged. That means I want to copy all of the files that are all of the layers that I have selected. And there are th currently three layers selected. Now that's on my clipboard. Can't see it, but I know it's there. So I'm going to hit Control D. I'm going to go ahead and click on this first layer so that um, when I paste what's on the clipboard, it's going to go on the layer above this. I'm going to go to the Edit drop down menu, or you can just hit Control V and hit Paste. And now I have all three of those here merged together on one layer. You can make these first three invisible save them as um, a working copies for later and I can add my drop shadows to those. So you can see how useful um, that copy merge tool uh, or shortcut which is also shift control C if you can remember that. I couldn't remember that because I don't use it often enough, but um, I know I can find it right there under the Edit drop-down menu. And so I hope this has been a helpful quick tip for you to uh, use the Copy Merge tool in your layouts. And um, I look forward to seeing what you can do with it.